Last month, Eminem released his first album in four years, Revival, which made him the only artist in history to debut eight straight albums at number one on the Billboard 200. In this week's Billboard cover story, M and his longtime manager, Paul Rosenberg, the newly appointed chairman and CEO of Def Jam Recordings, discuss a wide variety of topics, including Revival reaction, the future of hip hop, and the rapper's thoughts on President Donald Trump. Revival, of course, faced familiar criticism over the strains of misogyny and sexism, or for some political incorrectness that remain in the MC's lyrics, as well as polarizing attacks on Trump, kicked off in October with his explosive BET Hip Hop Awards freestyle, The Storm. This is for Colin, ball up a fist, and keep that shit ball like Donald the bitch. When discussing the backlash, Eminem says, I knew it would get a reaction, obviously. That's what I rapped to do. But where I was coming from in that cipher was a genuine place in my heart. I hesitate to say I have hatred in my heart for him, but it's serious contempt. I do not like the guy. He goes on to say, at the end of the day, if I did lose half my fan base, then so be it. Because I feel like I stood up for what was right, and I'm on the right side of this. I don't see how somebody could be middle class, busting their ass every single day, paycheck to paycheck, who thinks that that billionaire is gonna help you. The rapper did, however, address reaction from his fan base in a new verse on revival track, Chloroseptic, after the album's release. I know I say a lot of up shit, admits Eminem, but a lot of shit is said in jest. It's tongue in cheek. It's my artistic license to express myself. Last time I checked, Trump isn't an artist and doesn't have an artistic license. I'm not the president. The duo also discussed the future of hip hop as Rosenberg focuses on returning the label to what he sees as its four founding pillars, originality, authenticity, cutting edge artists, and rapper as rock star branding. Def Jam is the greatest hip hop label that has ever existed. I don't think there's much argument against that, he says. I don't want anybody to think I want to make it an old school hip hop label, because I don't. I want to follow that blueprint into the future with the kind of artist that exists now. To read the full article with much more from M and Rosenberg, head to billboard.com and make sure you pick up this week's issue of Billboard magazine. And let us know what you think in the comments. For Billboard News, I'm Neha Joy.